guys, welcome back to another video. Today I wanna to give you an update on all the newborn things that are happening around here. Peace is taking a good little nap right next to me. She's so sweet. So things are going mostly very, very well around here. <laughs> I'm doing great, I feel awesome. I, I always feel awesome at this part. That's not new for me. Oh, Seth is in the toilet playing he, phase. I'll be right back. Okay, back to our regular scheduled programming. Seth is like putting things in toilets now. That's his new thing. Lovely. Uh, luckily he can't open like knob handles, which we have on our main floor, so as long as that bathroom door stays shut, we're good. Peace is a very peaceful baby. She is very sweet, laid back. I can tell a little bit their personalities when they first come home. She's gonna be peaceful, <laughs> I can tell that. She's not gaining weight well. On day three, we saw the doctor. She was born at five pounds, nine ounces. Day three, she was five pounds, two ounces. I filmed day six when I finally got out the scale to weigh her at home, which I was supposed to be doing probably daily. <laughs> she had only gained one ounce. I think I was filming that day. I'm not sure if you've seen that video yet or not. It was the first time I gave her a bath. And she, uh, that day I realized I'm gonna have to do triple feeds. I started triple feeding her, which means you nurse and then feed her what you pumped the last time and then pump so it's like three feedings the only difference is i have a new kind of pump that is hands-free kind of suction thing i'll show you it is the best baby product literally the best baby product i have ever owned and it was i think 7.99 so cheap seven dollars and i <laughs> so baby products can be expensive so uh, anyway, I'm using that pump milk and then so I top her off with whatever I got out just to make sure she's getting milk. Still, for days, she would only gain an ounce every three days. I see the doctor, today's day 12, I see the doctor again on day 14, her two week birthday. We'll see how she does. Today and yesterday, she gained an ounce a day. Finally, that's what she should be gaining, I'm pretty sure. We're up to like five pounds, seven ounces on day 12. Feeding, when you do triple feeds like that, it just takes all day. Plus she's tiny, which just makes her a slower eater, I think. Anyway, I don't know. She wasn't really early, I'm very sure of that now. It does take a lot of time, which I enjoy that time, but I also have to do a lot here. So something that's been helping me a ton is, I usually don't let my friends do a meal train for me, which is something where people just sign up to bring you food and our church does that what? when people have a baby. <laughs> we do that for each other. But my best friend, she's she does a lot of our administration <laughs> at the office at church. And I always tell her, please don't do a meal train because I don't want to ask people for meals. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, Destiny, go, go. Okay, I can't remember what I was saying. Oh yeah, my friend, I usually ask her not to do a meal train because we're the lead pastors at our church. We also have the, by far the biggest family. So we're having a baby every couple of years over here or less and uh, nobody else is having babies that often <laughs> that many times. And so I just feel bad for asking other people. I feel like they feel obligation. Hold on. Okay, I'm back again. My grandma is not doing well and so I'm getting phone calls. I can't really leave the baby right now but my parents are both in town so that's good. So they're r running over to be with her and Judah needed to go pick up my dad. They were in two different places and are sharing one of our cars. So I was telling you my friend Heather, I don't let her usually do a meal train for us and but if people ask to bring us meals, I'm always extremely thankful. We usually get that about twice. Every time we have a baby like her, she usually brings a meal and then maybe one other family. Um, often will. Meals are such a blessing, I tell you. <laughs> it's kind of dark here. There we go. <laughs> uh, anyway, this time, six different people asked to bring us meals. I know it's very intimidating and overwhelming to cook for all, all of us. We're 12 people that are eating, and that's a lot. And so I'm so thankful. It has been extremely helpful because when I am stuck all the time feeding a baby, everybody else is trying to pick up the other slack and like the kids and my mom if she's around and Solo if he's around. So been very busy and the meals have been a huge help so that she scheduled them like every other day which is awesome. It's so awesome. So I think, I think bringing people a meal is one of the best gifts you can give. <laughs> very thankful to those women who asked to bring a meal over. And even a neighbor brought one. So I actually have had, I think, I have two more coming and I have had seven meals in this two weeks. So wonderful, can't even tell you how wonderful. <laughs> so that's how it's been going here, is just a lot of feeding this baby, trying to get her to lose weight. 
Ironically, I'm trying, no, she's trying to gain weight. I'm trying to lose weight. <laughs> That's how it goes, right? I weighed myself on day six, I think, after she was born, and I had lost zero, zero. I mean, I should have lost at least five pounds, nine ounces. <laughs> I lost nothing. So I've been eating low carb, and uh, I started that day six, and then I've lost a bunch now. Okay, I need to stop vlogging. Yeah, Sarah got one of her smiling. Yeah. So cute. Uh -huh. Do you want to hold her a minute? Well, no, uh, can I? <laughs> yeah, okay. all right. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. okay. All right, here we go. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Well, I hope I don't drop her. Oh. Whoa, Noel, you better help out. I don't know. <laughs> oh. Girls, I hope I don't drop her. Destiny can hold her. She's a good holder. You are? Yes, she I is. They're okay. all good. Okay. <laughs> Look Did at him. You flying. see the little girl I had? Yes. Mm -hmm. Isn't she beautiful? She was in my belly. You think we should take her with us? <laughs> uh, should we take her with us? No. No. Can, I, can we take her with us? Go get her, her winter coat on and her boots because I'm going to take her with me. Uh, she doesn't have boots yet? Not yet. How's she gonna play in the snow? Her coat. Uh, I don't think she's gonna, gonna like the like... snow this year. Yeah. No, she's not gonna see much of it this year. Okay. <laughs> we can have a look out the window. So tiny. I got old people. Okay. She's cute. She's cute. She's very little. <laughs> We're gonna call her Gussie. Gussie. <laughs> this is Gussie. For grandma. After Gussie. my grandmother, my grandmother. <laughs> yeah. This is Gussie. Mm -hmm. Is she impressed with that? No, she ain't even no. awake. She's worried about it. Papa, I thought you were gonna feed her. Yeah. I, I tried, <laughs> and she just didn't like it. I'll tell you what though, if you can get me some peanut butter, or what else go, oh, even a little honey. Isn't honey good for children? <laughs> Picking the two things you're not supposed to give him, huh? Look at you. <laughs> Mama? We're on a plane I'm gonna go to the zoo and we got to have you thought about marriage at all? Is there anybody you want? Is there anybody you Who want the most? Yeah, to, to be oh, hooked really? to for the rest of your life? <laughs> You're very <laughs> happy being a specialist. <laughs> Do you love holding that baby? All right, it's the next morning. My parents just left. They are driving to St. Louis and then flying home. We have family in St. Louis. They're gonna go see. So my mom has been so helpful for three weeks, basically. She's been here. We will miss her. And my dad was here for one day. We already miss her. Look at the dishes. <laughs> yeah. Look at the sink. Oh my goodness. So today, we're gonna try to get some house projects done. Oh, I know one other thing I was gonna tell you. Well, let me show you the first house project that we've been putting off that we needed to do. We added a leaf to the table. It has been very crowded at dinner time. People are getting long, that's right. <laughs> yep, so we added a leaf, and then let me show you a before picture of Micah. And here's the after. Ooh, got his braces off. His gums are a little irritated from the braces. How does it feel though? Amazing. Yeah, so smooth. He's got a retainer in there. Actually, we should have showed it without the retainer because it looks kind of funny. There we go. Looking good, man. So that was a big day for him two days ago. We were trying to occupy Seth here while I was nursing. He uh, abandoned the fun, but we got a lot of things to do today, right? You, oh, man. We as in you. <laughs> yeah. Around this house. Survival. Uh, yeah. We got like light bulbs to replace, just little things. You know, yeah. sometimes you just gotta do the stuff. So since he's around here helping me, he never gets to ends. do the stuff today. He never ends, right? Oh, I just keep finding diapers I he forgot to throw ends. away. No, for sure not. This is how I'm surviving right now. I got some toys in front of me. We 
kind of blocked off the living room, nursing a baby. Noelle's supposed to be doing her schoolwork over there at the table. No hair have been done. No heads have been combed, whatever. <laughs> However you see it, we got something on the TV just to help keep them in this area. <laughs> We're making it. Solo's working a little bit. Eli just learned how to do a backflip. Go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> how do you feel? <laughs> the next thing we're doing is cleaning out this sunroom we have. It is extremely hot in the summer, extremely cold in the winter. There's no temperature control on it at all. We're cleaning it out, getting it ready for um, the winter, but also we have someone come to look at it to maybe change it. <laughs> All right, here's the progress. We painted some tables that were rusty a little. Belle did that actually with some spray paint. We brought out our chairs from our dining room that are actually indoor outdoor chairs. We've had these for a number of years, love them, but we're getting new ones in our dining room. So we want these out here and just to have a nice space to eat. We're thinking about turning this into a deck, which I think it was originally a deck. <laughs> and the previous owners, we heard they got some like uh, these panels I don't want to call them glass because they're not real glass I don't think and they made a sunroom out of it but the temperature control issues are so real <laughs> fall and spring is the only time we can use it well so we'd love it to be a deck again because our deck is really tiny so anyway that's where we're at we got to do something with all those baby gates <laughs> that have to live out here this child is on a strict two and a half hour schedule all day long and she's hard to wake up it's very rare that she's actually asking for food at two and a half hours come on missy I usually gotta get her undressed. <laughs> Are you smiling about that? Did I see a smile? I don't know why she looks so big on camera, but she is very tiny. Very, very, she was 18 inches long. Most of my kids are 21 when they're born. And she's just a little squirt. I have her on that schedule because I want her to gain weight. I don't wake her up every two and a half hours at night. I do have to wake her and she doesn't wake up. She will sleep all night. I'm trying to get her to gain weight by her. Tomorrow's her appointment to weight check and we're close to birth weight. She's will be two weeks old, but not quite there. Mm, what do you think, Nessa? <laughs> you like that baby? You wanna check her out? <gasps> What's she doing? What's she doing? Mm-hmm. Oh yes, I know. Oh, she woke up. I gotta show you her eyes. Hi. Oh, so pretty. What is this day? What are we doing? Did you wake me up to feed me again? <laughs> oh boy. Are you tired of all this eating? It's so much work. <laughs> she is gaining about an ounce a day the last couple days. So that's good. Good. She's done good work. <laughs> oh my. That's a big bow child. Oh, let's just take it off. Let's take it off. Okay, so this is the pump I told you about. We Don't mind the ladder, we were changing the light bulbs. This is literally all it is, $7.99, man. You just kind of fold it back, squeeze it, put it on, and it suctions to you on the side you're not nursing on. And I usually get, I don't know, one to two and a half ounces on the side. And then I nurse on the other side and switch it. And it gives me some milk without the time of pumping. And then you just rinse it out, it's so easy best purchase ever i will link it down below if you're interested they have a bigger one too this is only like three ounces i think maybe four total and they have a bigger one that has a base on it so you don't spill it and i bought a top for it but i hardly ever use it so i just dump it out into a bottle right away and that's how we roll Bye. You're, my friend. <laughs> you're my friend <laughs> What do you guys think about our new dining area? <laughs> yeah. It's a new white baby. <laughs> progress we 
So let's get an oil change in the van. We got rid of three mattresses, right, Luca? <laughs> the mattresses Eli was flipping on. We just put them on line. Oh, Nessa, do you need something? <laughs> Can you get her water, please? Nessa. We uh, put the mattresses online for free. For free? Someone just came and got them, yeah. <laughs> Three twin mattresses that we had extra. It was a funny situation. We were just laughing because Solo was gone at the time, but um, they a van pulled up full of kids and they sent the little kids up <laughs> to the door to ask for the mattresses. I was like, oh, okay. Anyway, the boys went and took them out to the car for him. So it's feeling like we're getting things accomplished today, even though I've spent almost the whole day feeding a baby. So the it's nice and clear in here without the chairs, but we basically ordered this chair. I was just waiting for the price to come back down. Finally did. So we ordered that for the table. And now that the table's bigger, should be comfortable to have them around the table. But I'm kind of digging this room out here. I hope we're able to make it into a deck. We'll see how it goes. We still gotta get rid of the gate. We haven't had a work at home day for a long time. And I think we did pretty good, considering I didn't do much. <laughs> we got some stuff done, a few things, it's good. Thank you guys for watching today. I feel like everything's a little calmer now around here. A bit more put together. Solo did ask, why is the kitchen so messy? Are the kids usually not doing their zones as well? <laughs> it's like my mom just left. I think she's been picking up the slack. <laughs> anyway, I'll, I'll write on here what her weight was at her doctor visit tomorrow when I'm editing this. So you can see if she made it back to her birth weight, which is five pounds, nine ounces. I don't think she's gonna squeak by. We'll keep you updated on how it goes around here. I just got back from the doctor's office and she made it back to her birth weight, so I feel like all my hard work paid off. <laughs> all her hard work paid off, so yay!